Namaste everyone. Welcome to our 51 tricks of maths course. And today's our trick is simplification part 2. If you haven't watched the part 1, so please go and watch that first part please. And then come to watch this part 2. So let's start. but the sign between them was plus right but here all the questions you can see all the questions in square roots up to infinity square root in square root square root in square root square root and square root all the questions here are of negative subtraction in the previous part they are all of positive addition here they are of subtraction okay so now what is the difference between addition and subtraction Okay, that, that, also, that will also I am going to tell you. But for that, first what we have to do is, first find out the consecutive factors. What are the consecutive factors that I have already shared in the previous part? Here short me bata deti hu. Consecutive factors means what? The factors that comes one after. Matlab, suppose let's say, two, uh, consecutive factor of 2 is 3. Consecutive number of uh, 4 is 5. Consecutive number of 100 is 101. The next number that is called as successor 2. Okay. Okay. So for the 12. So what are the consecutive factors of 12? So let's find out the factors of 12. 1 times 12. Then 2 times 6. And then 3 times 4. These are the factors of 12. First of all then out of all these 3 factors let me know which are the consecutive factors. Which factors comes with 1 after? So that is 3 and 4. Right. So, unka difference jo hai, 1 hai. So, what you have to do is write down 3 and 4. Now, here the sign is subtraction. Here the sign is subtraction. That's why we have to choose the lowest number. Smallest number. Okay. So, we have the answer is 3. Okay. If it was addition, so first part mein addition tha, to hum logo ne greatest factor choose kiya. Yaha we subtraction and we are going to choose the smallest factor. Okay, so find out the factors of 56. 1 into 56, 2 into 28, then 4 into 14, then 7 times 8. So which are the consecutive? Yes, that's correct. 7 and 8 and because the signs are subtraction so we are going to choose the we are going to choose the smallest factor that's correct and the answer is 7 that's it we don't have to do anything here we don't have to do anything here we don't have to do anything here what we have to do is the simple thing is we have to find out the consecutive factors Consecutive factors find karo. Usme se subtraction hai to chota factor choose karo. Addition hai to bada factor choose karo. And that is going to be the answer of that question. Very simple. This question is asked in most of the competitive exam. And isko solve karne mein bachche aadha aadha ghanta waste karte hai. Aur kitne second mein answer aaja ta iska? Only in one second. Yeah. And this question is for homework right? So please do the homework. Remember, 30 minutes of practice of this math tricks is compulsory. If you are giving any competitive exam, if you are in school, if you are in college, if you want to fast your calculation, just solve these questions and daily practice of 30 minutes is compulsory. Okay? So thank you so much for watching this trick. Stay tuned for the part 3. See you guys in the next trick. Bye-bye. Take care.